Hi, and welcome to Girl Talk. Wow, we've got a show for you today. Our friend Ronnie Lynn is here, Aaron is here. We are at Superior Heating and Air Conditioning, and we're very excited to be here. How are you? I'm doing well. How are we've you? been having a ball. You know, it's really interesting. We always chat a little bit about how our day's going to go, what we're going to talk about. And it's interesting because I, I, I think we should give her a couple of kudos. We're talking, well, you're like, oh my gosh. That's we're talking about being involved in the community. Mm -hmm. And I've been here for 150,000 years. You've been here for a long time. And we're talking about all the things that are going on with you in the community, and you're super active too. Mm -hmm. And you said you just got an ambassadorship. I did. For, this is um, kind of for exciting. Bucking, that's right? really cool. Yeah. Uh -huh. And what does yeah. that mean? Just um, you, you, I. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the person. Uh, the person, the ambassador. Um, is one of the people that helps to represent the Greater Bluffton Chamber and to go around to make sure our members are taken care of and if they have any questions and to just be a face for the chamber and for the community. So I I'm can't think really cool. of anybody better to do that. I think that's, in, that's fantastic. And we were talking about Mayfest too. Mm -hmm. How was that? Tell us a little bit about that. And what part does the Rotary have to do with that? Um, the Rotary actually is the one that puts on the event. So it is a huge undertaking. It is one of the things that helps us to raise money mm -hmm. to help provide um, funds for charities. And we review charities and go through and you know donate money to specific events or to not events, but to specific mm -hmm things that request the money. We have a panel that reviews everything. So um, Mayfest has actually started a really long time ago as the Bluffton Village Festival. Right. And then when Rotary took it over from okay. the woman that originally started it, um, it was kind of coined Mayfest. And we've brought back the Bluffton Village Festival. So it, it has both names, but um, it's so much like fun. one of our it biggest events yes. here. It's so huge and it's, it's a blast exactly. and all of the local businesses get to come out and you know show their their and goods. And it was and a little rainy, but people did it come out. Oh, oh, yeah. I heard the rain didn't hurt it. anybody. No. We love days like this because it's really just about us right now. <laughs> it's all <laughs> about us. It is. It's all about us right now. <laughs> Speaking of us, we're off, off to see, see the wizard. <laughs> yes, my daughter's playing Dorothy over at Main Street Youth Theater. Will do How old are your kids? Um, 13 and 19. Well, they might be able to They're right up there, yeah. <laughs> so, so, I mean, well, they would love it if you could get them there, but right? it's getting them there. That's the real But it is going to be a great show. When do you, what's the um, scoop with that? Well, it's going to open the end of the month. Um, Dan Brown is the director. Okay. And he um, was formerly an actor at Main Street Youth Theater, so he's got a lot of energy and he's youthful. Um, it's going to be a big, big cast. Is it really? Yes. Great music. I love You're that. You're going to have to bring your grandkids. I really want to do it. What, yes. Do you know when it is? Well, I know it opens the end of June. I don't have specific dates to roll okay. out right now, but um, I'm also into early part of July. It's kind of a big time of year right now between mm -hmm. kids graduating from high school. Yeah. Coming home from college. Oh, yes. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. No, where, where, what's your oldest one? Um, my son's 19. He goes to Florida Atlantic University. Oh, he does? Is yes. he home yet? Yes, he actually works here during the summer. So this is his third year. Is here. he here? That's great. Um, he, I, he's around here somewhere. What's his major? Well, how did we miss him? What is it? Yeah, what's he, what is he majoring? Um, we're, we're in the process of changing. He was majoring in... Don't you um, know this? We are in getting the process his, of changing. <laughs> right. <laughs> we are. Yeah. Um, it, it's going to be in the medical field of some sort. We were going for um, nurse practitioner, getting his doctorate in nurse That's practitioner. Amazing. Yes. Good for him. So he's over um, that now? Um, no, not over it, but we, we may be just changing the focus of the medical just segue a little bit. So <laughs> well, we're this. looking at all of that right now. Yeah. That's not unusual though. No, no, no not at all. Good As you get in here, Major, you really Why did I out. think your kids were like thirteen and nine? I don't know. <laughs> you're so and you're like, no. no. And where's your daughter in school? Um, she's at River Ridge Academy. Okay, and so oh. Mm -hmm. She's got one so year left. Is, yeah, I was going to say, she yeah. would be going on to May River or um, Bluffton yeah, High. Yeah, she hasn't decided yet. Okay. So we're still a little, she's got one more year to decide which school. So and Grace okay. going to be in high school. I know, isn't it? <laughs> well, and you've had a great week. Her son broke her leg. Yes, His my leg. other son. My, yes. yes. 
There are five kids in this family, so yeah. <laughs> there's always a broken something. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, we did. We called Erin, and we were like, are you okay? She goes, it's a leg. And it's the second leg. Like, like, he's broken, so we're just kind of, you know, everyone's like, the outpouring of support has been amazing, but it's been kind of funny to me because I'm like, this is normal in our life. <laughs> it doesn't you know, feel as yeah, stressful as you think. So he's doing well, though, and he'll be, you know, 17-year-olds bounce back. Mm -hmm. Exactly. What, right. do, what do the kids do, a lot of the kids that you know do in the summers these days? Are there camps? Are there volunteer opportunities? Um, Jobs? Work? work, work yeah. is really our goal. Right. right. <laughs> yeah. Make Earn money. Make money. I'll yeah. Yeah. Keep oh. productive days. Yeah. Right. Doing something. Other than that, though, my kids are really enjoying just living by the beach mm -hmm. and yeah. getting out there with their friends on paddle boards mm -hmm. and fishing and enjoying our It's been perfect location. paddle board weather. It has. Beautiful breezes. It really is. We're going to take a quick break. We're going to come back on Girl Talk, and we're going to talk about what none of us know much about. You more than all of us, though. You do know <laughs> a little bit about solar energy. Stay with us. Girl Talk is brought to you by Custom Audio Video, the Westin Resort and Spa, Buford Memorial Hospital, and by New River Auto Mall. Please support these local businesses as they make this program possible.